guys. Do you guys recognize this friend I have here today? Well, if you don't, I'll give you some hints and then I bet you can guess it. Sometimes he has really cool sunglasses. Other times he has really groovy buttons. And sometimes he has white shoes. I bet you guessed it. It's our friend Pete the Cat. And today I'm bringing you one of our favorite Pete the Cat stories. I love my white shoes. So I bet you guys can sing along to this groovy book with me. Pete the Cat was walking down the street in his brand new white shoes. Pete loved his white shoes so much he sang this song. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. Oh no. Pete stepped in a pile of strawberries. What color did it turn his shoes? Red. Did Pete cry? Goodness no. He kept walking along and singing his song. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. <gasps> oh no. Pete stepped in a pile of blueberries. What color did it turn his shoes? <gasps> Blue. Did Pete cry? Goodness no. He kept walking along and singing his song. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. Oh no, Pete stepped in a large puddle of mud. What color did it turn his shoes? Brown. Did Pete cry? Goodness no. He kept walking along and singing his song. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. <gasps> oh no, Pete stepped in a bucket of water and all the brown and all the blue and all the red were washed away. <gasps> what color were his shoes again? White, but now they were wet. Did Pete cry? Goodness no, he kept walking along and singing his song. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. The moral of Pete's story is no matter what you step in, keep walking along and singing your song. Because it's all good. Thank you guys for joining Pete and I today. I hope you're all doing well and we miss 